Hello, today I'm gonna show you how to use this package to get your aboy in VC phase or leave. The only thing that you will need for this is the right int version. I'm gonna put the link on the description. You can just open a project and drag, drag the package, the VRM package. This is, this is all. There is no component to download. Everything is in. So what's new with this package? Um, first of all, for VC face, you will have new expressions, the blush, uh, the AI stars, and Poyomi shader support. Means that you can go for emissions and stuff like that. For leave, we are losing Poyomi shaders, sadly, because there is no SDK for them so you will be limited to the vrm shaders but you win the practicality of having your model for leave inside of the same package than vc face and the main reason why i i did that is because vrm um support visims like the the fact that your avatar is talking when you do. So you're still free to use the old package for leave that will allow you to use Poyomi shaders, but you won't be able to talk. Your avatar won't talk. Okay, so first of all, uh, let's set up an avatar for VC face. So we have the standard idea and the female one. We're gonna go for the female and all you need to do is to change your textures. I'm, I'm gonna do it for just one just to remind you how to do so. So you go in material, VC face, uh, let's change the body and then maps, female, body. You put it on the little case in here and you're good. Uh, I'm gonna show you how to add props to the model. Uh, the tiny antlers, for example. You need the FBX in here being unpackaged. So if it is blue, you will need to right click and unpack prefab. In here, it's already done. It, it is gray, so it is unpacked already. So you just need to go for the head bone, in that case here and drop the antlers then you will need to unpack this go to prefabs in here and drop it here it's gonna recreate a prefab with your antlers and you are already ready to export so you go to you select your model it's very important you go to VC Face SDK, export avatar bundle, and you can save it wherever you want. So here is the UI of VC Face. I will give you the link to download it on the description. You will start by adding your the model you just exported. So um this one in my case you click on it select here we go so this is what I just exported you can use alt and then the different buttons of your mouse to zoom in zoom out rotate and uh, move then you will go to settings general settings um, I prefer to use auto blink and auto audio lip sync. I, I think it is better, but it's a matter of taste. Then you will need to set up your camera and your mic microphone. And the virtual camera thing is um, for Discord. Then you can close this and go to expression settings. And here is where you're gonna choose your hotkeys for your expressions. 
um, there is something important that you need to know is that every single expressions will need to be base in here not additive except for the blush the blush needs to be additive and sparkling needs to be additive it means that you will be able to play those two animations uh, independently from the rest so you can mix them up for example if i go for the blush okay it's turning my my material because i didn't export it the right way but it, it is fine you see the blush and then i can have the sparkly eyes i, I can still play the other animations as you can see and you you're good to go um vc phase is very easy to set up and i'm back okay so now for leave you will need to use those uh you will change your materials you can also add props if you want to and then when you're done you also need to click the model go to vrm uni vrm no point 61 something export humanoid it's gonna open this you can change the picture and the title if you want you cannot change this and then make sure that nothing is checked in here and then you can export the leave setup is already explained in another tit another tutorial of mine that you can check. I will I will give you the link in the description. Uh, so that's it. Uh, it's it's extremely easy to use. Um, the only the only problem with the VRM files is that you cannot change your FBX. You cannot swap it if you have a custom model you won't be able to use that package you will be you will have to do the work from scratch that's it have fun